In this video, I'm going to show you how to take an image and make it into a template that you can use for yourself to pop in some other images. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to create a design. For this one, I'm just going to choose Instagram because I want a square image. I'm going to click over here on the left where it says uploads and I'm going to upload files. So I'm going to select all of the different files that I'm going to want to put onto my image. And okay, now that I have all those up there, I'm going to take the image that I want to be the background and I'm going to drag it in and you will see that it'll put it in as the whole background. Now I want to put something in each of these boxes and I can just drag these in and resize them. But what I can do to make things a little bit easier for me is put some frames in here. So then it will automatically resize to the correct dimensions. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on elements over here on the left and I'm going to search for frame and I'm going to look for the square frame. If there's all different shapes, if you wanted something, uh, if you wanted something else. So here is the frame. And what I'm going to do is I am going to size this down and make this fit into the box. So I'm going to zoom in because this allows me to see better how to make it fit. And then once I have it once, I can just duplicate this because in this case, all of my other boxes are the same. So I'm going to click duplicate. I'm going to put that approximately there. I'll zoom back in afterwards to get these to be a little in the right spots. So there we go. Okay, now I'm going to zoom back in. And I am just going to kind of move these boxes so that they get to be the way I want them to do to be. And sometimes moving it with my mouse moves it too much. So I use the arrow keys on my keyboard to move things in smaller increments. So let me just go ahead and finish adjusting all of these. Okay, so now that I have them there, I can go back to my uploads and now I can find the images that I want to bring and I can just grab them and pop them into these frames and it automatically puts them into these boxes so that I don't have to do all the resizing and time. And now I kind of have a template made that I can use. And now I can go ahead and download it and use this image wherever I want. If I want to replace pictures with anything, I could easily put another picture on top of it and it automatically resizes the box. I hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave.